back to Vaughn. A victory today, and she eclipses Hermann Meyer, and at the same time ties him on the winner's list with 54 wins. And, and really no changes from yesterday when she dominated this course. Good inspection, stick to the plan, and stay inside the tracks. And Vaughn already has the lead. Yesterday we thought the course had no more speed left in it, and Vaughn won the downhill by almost a second. And, and, and it always amazes me, how is she able to tuck these Super G turns? Somehow she gets that hip in there, gets it on edge, yet remains in the aerodynamic position. Oh, just connecting the whole course very, very smooth. No problems. Lindsay Vaughn, Look at that at speed. Her, yeah, unbelievable. At her limit, she has no rivals, and she is up by nearly a full second in less than a minute of skiing. She's not going after Ravensburg. She's going after Herman Meyer. Really chasing the ghosts of World Cup skiing. Uh -oh. Catching a little air there, and we're running a little bit late. You saw the deceleration, but up oh. by 1.22. And that line problem up there, she touches her hand. She was all over the place. Can see salvage it. She was 1.22 up, Steve. Uh, two big mistakes there, but Vaughn had a big patch. She'll get to the finish line. Oh, boy, and not enough for Vaughn. 1.22 up. She loses almost 1.8 in the final turns. And it started right after the traverse, Doug. I mean, a nice high line above the traverse. She had to just get a little bit more direction. And this is the outcome of the mistake. Look at her in the soft stuff. Kills her speed. Just amazing that she can lose that much on that one mistake. And that's that snow conditions. If it's, it's, if it's, if it's winter conditions, does she lose the race? No, no, because she just hammers her ski and is right back in the course. And her sister often travels with her. I mean, she's has off the also course. disappointed. So Lindsey Vaughn throwing up a wall of snow there and throws her hands up as she does not get the victory. The 2,000 points will have to wait for another day. Today, she was good enough to seal up the Super G title in Schlabing, Austria.